meron tayo dito. Magsabi siya sa amin na magpaparaffle daw siya ng art toys. Ang hirap magbuo ng team. Hey guys, Carlo here. Welcome to episode 7 ng Bet Vlogs. Nakakapitong episode na tayo sa lahat ng mga nanonood. Maraming maraming salamat po sa inyo lahat. We appreciate every single one of you. Lalong-lalo na yung mga nagko-comment, nagla-like at nag-share ng aming content. And by the way, make sure to do that in today's episode. Ngayon, ano ba mangyayari today? Ngayon, medyo chill lang tayo guys. Meron ako mga dalawang sapatos na gusto ko unbox. Uh, binili ko to from Cupcakes. Uh, we have two pairs of Jordans which are super, super sick and dope. And then we'll follow it up by talking about unbox con. And then may konting kwento si Lea tungkol naman sa mga hardships in hiring people. So kung naghahanap kayo ng trabaho at feeling ninyong gusto niyo maging part ng team unbox, this is the video for you. Now before we get to the unboxing, quick note lang, may nagtanong, bakit daw biglang nagkaroon ng wedding footage after ng parang clips about a watch review that we did last time, no? So, for those who don't know, medyo nag-transform na yung video natin, ang vlog natin. Medyo pinapakita ko na sa inyo yung behind the scenes of what we're doing uh, in the group, no? So, talaga halo-halo na yan. May mga unboxing. At the same time, you get to meet the different people that are part of Unbox and the different things that we're doing. And with that said, punta na tayo sa unang sapatos na i-unbox natin. Meron tayo dito. Dadan! O nga pala, shoutout kay Cup Keep Cup Kicks. Mula kay Sir Alfie Rojas, maraming salamat sa pag-hookup. Ay, teka, wag muna to. Actually, sige, ito na lang. Unahin na natin to. So, ito, para sa mga anime fan, sobrang matutuwa kayo dito. This is from Jordan Brand and Zion Williamson. So, this is the Air Jordan 37 Zion, size 13. Buksan natin. Ganda ng box. Kitang-kita nyo naman dyan. Tapos parang, et, ano ba ibig sabihin nito? Ryan, ano ibig sabihin nito? <laughs> Buksan na natin. So, ito na siya. Ito yung tinatawag na Naruto Rasengan Sneakers. So, Rasengan, because of those who, who watch Naruto, uh, like me, ito yung kulay nung parang energy ball na mula gawa sa wind tsaka chakra na ginagamit niya to attack his opponents. So, yan yung inspiration behind this. This is the second Naruto-inspired sneaker of Zion Williamson with Jordan Brand, which just proves that he's a massive Naruto fan. Talaga, no? If you take a closer look uh, at different details of the sneaker, dito sa gilid, dito sa may collar, may makita kayo parang whiskers or three streak marks. Na makita din sa cheek ni Naruto yan. Tapos kung titingin kayo dito sa tang tab, isuzoom na lang tumamaya dun sa B-roll, no? Parang yung, yung steel plate, yung headband ng mga ninja ng Konoha at saka ng Naruto, nakikita din nyo dyan. So parang, parang kinopia nila yung element na yun. And you also have, of course, laces. Tapos pag titignan nyo dito sa likod, nakasulat, syempre kailangan ng motivational, inspirational chucho nakalagay, believe it. O, diba? Tapos if you take a look at the bottom, your typical uh, Jordan 37 na yan na, na details and material. So this is the right pair. Tignan natin yung left. So mga Naruto fans, comment kayo, is this something that you guys would want to rock? Is this something that you guys would want to wear? Oh, may Japanese pala dito. Siguro yun din yung ibig sabihin na to, no? So, I don't know. I guess, yun din yung ibig sabihin. Believe it, di ba? So, yun. Ah, parang ano? Parang book pala ni Naruto. Ito naman doon, yellow. O, oh, yan. So, yun yung unang pair na bubuksan natin. So, this one I got because, one, I love anime-inspired sneakers, being a geek myself. Uh, and I own the first pair. And when I saw it, I just wanted to get the, the second uh, Zion Naruto uh, shoe. Now, the second sneaker is something na feeling ko paglalawayan ni, ni Von. Von, magpakita ka dito. Okay, dito. So, sa mga nanonood ng unbox, or tumitingin ng unbox Green Hills Facebook page, ito ang aming poster. Pakita ka. Yan. Yan yung mga ganun, tsaka kung ano-ano mga videos namin. So, yun lang. HR head namin yan, by the way. hindi ka panipaniwala. Ano? So, ito ang Jordan 3 White Cement Reimagine. So, para sa akin, ito yung pinakamagandang sapatos na lumabas this year from Jordan Brand, period. Meron ka namang idea kung ano pa ilalabas for the rest of the year. Eh. Sa mga sapatos na nakikita ko, parang ito na yung pinakagusto ko. Eh. And hindi na ako masyado mong ibili ng sapatos lately. So, the fact na I went out of my way to be able to get this pair just speaks volumes on how much I like it. So, kung titignan ninyo yung box, parang may wear and tear na siya. Yun yun, di ba, Ray? Parang, yun yung parang theme nila eh. Parang, what would the Jordan 3 look like kung medyo nag-age na siya? So, pati yung box, binigay nila yung parang distressed age look. Now, if you pop it open, it's your typical Jordan 3 packaging. Pero, tingnan nyo naman yan. Napakalinis. Grabe. Amoy pa lang, oh. 
amoy glue at factory na social, o, diba? So, you have the typical Jordan 3 elements, very clean white upper, you have that elephant cement look or detail, you have the Jumpman logo na embroidered sa tongue tab, and yung kakaiba sa kanya, if you take a look at the back, yung, ano ba tawag dito, heel guard or shin guard, o, ayoko, basta back plate, <laughs> parang nag-age, parang nag-yellow na. Kasi nga, yun yung parang ano nila, na if it was reimagined, parang tumanda siya. Yan yun, di ba? So, nanilaw na ng konti dito. Kahit yung midsole, kung titignan ninyo, it's not pristine, clean, white. Medyo nag yellow na siya ng konti. Kasi that is what happens to shoes over time. Even yung eyelets, kung titignan ninyo, medyo nag yellow na rin ng konti. So, yun yung parang look. Yun yung parang design that they were going for for this sneaker. So, if you're a fan of aged sneakers or yung mga sneakers na Jordan 3 in general, para sa akin, this is really one of the most must-cop pairs of 2023. So, big shout-out again to uh, Boss Alfie for the hookup on both sneakers. I appreciate you, bro. Guys, if you're looking for kicks, nasa na yung ano nila? Make sure to drop by or Cup Kicks. Check nyo yung Facebook nila. Napakabait na na boss tong si Boss Alfie. So, make sure to support him no, in his business. So, before we move on to the next segment, plug ko lang. Unbox Con is happening May 20 to 21. Um, si Rai will talk more about it in a bit. But before I pass it over to him, guys, super excited to share. Nakita nyo naman, nag-announce ako sa Facebook. Uh, si Seth Fowler is confirmed uh, to be able to visit us during that time. So, pupunta siya dito sa Manila. 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 Uh, he'll be there at UnboxCon. And he'll be joining. Um, joining him will be uh, si Paul Fuentavella from Locus Wild and Honey. So, we have two superstar sneaker streetwear culture icons from the US that will be flying over to be with us to celebrate UnboxCon on May 20 to 21 sa SMX MOA. Tickets, by the way, will be available starting March 15 on Lazada. We will put the link down below. So, kung gusto niyo na bilhin yung ticket niyo in advance, you can go down to the link, bilhin niyo na para meron na kayo. Kasi nagkakaubusan talaga yan. Promise, mabilis magkaubusan yan. Lalong-lalo na with Seth and Paul plus all of the other guests that we have lined up plus all of the exclusive drops that will be happening which Ryan will be talking about. So with that said, again, shout out to Cupcakes. Let's check out ano meron sa UnboxCon updates with Mr. Ryan. So me and the UnboxCon team, uh, may mga pinuntang kaming mga uh, personalities sa mga shops the past couple of weeks. Ito yung mga in-invite namin for UnboxCon this coming May 2023. Una ang pinuntahan namin si Boss Biggs or Big Boy Cheng. So si Boss Biggs of course, he will be there sa UnboxCon. Tapos uh, magsabi siya sa amin na magpaparaffle daw siya ng art toys. So yun, very ano yun, sa sobrang inaabangan ng mga tao. Then we head over to Aftermarket. Aftermarket, of course it's a green list lang yun. Uh, we filmed a couple of videos with Matt and Kenneth. Tapos, nag uh, b rolls yung kami sa, sa loob ng store nila. Then, after that, kay Randrell naman, another sneaker store. Uh, kaya lang dinamin na si Randrell doon. Nagpunta sila sa somewhere. So, ito yung mga abangan ninyo for both Randrell and Aftermarket. For number one, yung mga latest na sneakers ngayong March, of course, April and May. So, doon. Nan? Number two, siyempre yung mga... Sorry. Number two, yung mga deals. Hello. Number two, yung mga deals na usually nakikita nyo sa store nila, mas mura pa. Ang daming steals. Sa... Pwe! Yun? Yun mismo? <laughs> Shit. Shit. Number two, siyempre yung mga steel deals. Yung mga great deals lagi for Randrell and Aftermarket. And number three, you get to meet in person si Randrell, si Matt, saka siyempre si Kenneth. Then nagpunta rin kami kay Coziest tsaka kay Manila Kingpin. Coziest, one of the biggest ngayon na local brands. Tapos si Manila Kingpin is a sportswear brand slash basketball brand. Para silang ano, a streetwear meets a basketball. So, uh, we plan to release a uh, unbox con, exclusive release ng Kingpin for the graphic tees. Then the past week na sa namin, officially darating si Seth Fowler. Maglalaba siya ng exclusive ng brand niya ng socks. So again, May 20 to 21 sa SMX Convention Center, Unbox Con, Kita Kids. 
grabe no, ang daming pasabog sa unbox ko. So make sure that you guys buy your tickets now. As in, yung link nasa baba, click nyo na yan, bili na kayo from Lazada. Kasi sobrang mag enjoy tayo doon, kita-kits tayo doon, uh, shopping tayo together, over 200 plus merchants, sobrang daming steel deals, sobrang daming activities, sobrang daming exclusive drops, exclusive guests. It is the most FOMO event of the year for our culture. So make sure to be there, okay? Now at this point, para naman business updates tayo, papasa ko kay Lea. Pag-uusapan natin ang hirap ng pag-hire. At kung gusto naman nyo sumama at mag-join sa amin dito sa Team Unbox, this segment is for you guys. So Lea, take it away. Ang hirap magbuo ng team. Because uh, right now, nag-hire ang UCN and Unbox PH. UCN is Unbox Creator Network, yun yung talent management agency natin. We are looking for a marketing specialist. And sa Unbox PH naman, we are looking for a sales manager. So in short, marami naman kasing nag apply But syempre, we're looking for a specific skill set, specific, you know, certain attitude na alam natin will be in line with the vibe and the culture of the company. So it's been a little challenging. At since nandito naman ang camera, nakatapat na sa akin at nagsasalita na ako. Guys, if you wanna be part of Team Unbox, please send your CV to one our HR manager slash meme lord. So, ipapakita namin nandito or nandito yung email address niya. Please send, yeah, please send it along with mga latest niyo na photos. Ganon, hindi. Actually, just a bit about the position that we're looking for for the account sales slash account manager for Unbox PH. So, ito yung humaharap sa mga clients natin, mga brand partners, mostly tech. Um, we... We service their needs in a sense na kung ano yung kailangan nila from unbox na YouTube video ba to, article ba to, siya yung front facing sa client. And then for UCN naman, for the marketing specialist, ideally merong experience sa digital marketing. So it's really about growing our assets and coming up with strategies para mapabida naman natin yung talents natin. And we have really, really good talents. So... With that, we need a kick-ass team to reach our lofty goals for the year. So, yeah, send your CV to Vaughn. So, what is our lesson of the day? Dalawa. Number one, pumunta kay Unbox God. <laughs> lesson yun, importante yun. Support, yun, support tayo sa istisa. Pero more importantly, to those who... Siguro pinaka-key lesson natin. Guys, take your shot if you wanna... If you want to work with us, if you're looking for a job and you feel like you're up for it, um, wala naman masama if you try. No? And it's the same thing with life. Kung gusto niyo to go for something, if you don't try, if you don't ask, if you don't take their shot, then you'll never know. And regret is the one thing that you never want to have uh, when you're when you're in your deathbed. Well, allow you, allow you no deathbed na kagad, mag apply lang for a job. Correct, exactly. So, yun ang ating lesson for the day. Okay? Guys, maraming salamat. See you again next week for the next episode of Bet Vlogs.